is Judith Cohen. I'm here at the Slate Gray South Gallery and I'm having a show called Rewired. So I moved to Telluride in 1985, which is a long time ago, but I've been working in art and in a lot of different media the whole time I've been here in Telluride. And so things I, I've evolved as an artist. I've, my media has changed. I've done a lot of different things. Uh, I've worked in the arts and I would say I'm excited to be working full time now in a in sort of a new media that I haven't that I'm combining from a lot of different things that I've done over the years. And so the the work in my current show here at Slate Gray South is a combination of a couple different processes. I start with deconstructive or breakdown screen printing on cotton fabric, and that is the base of the painting. I then attach that to some wooden panels and then um, collage pieces together to make a beautiful composition, which I then cover with encaustic wax, beeswax and resin. And then I will do some surface technique where I scratch into the piece with uh, different material and then um, do a surface design on the top. So in my free time, I spend a lot of time outside. I am a real outdoors person. I have been whitewater rafting for many, many years and have been down the Colorado River 11 times on a trip. And being outside has really enriched my life in so many ways. I feel like every day I'm outside either biking or skiing or hiking or just walking in the woods. And that environment has really has brought a lot of imagery into my work and has just enriched me personally. And so I'm, I feel really grateful. And the, all the different media that I've done throughout my career as an artist, including painting and drawing and um, many other things, and caustic and sculpture, I feel like it's all tied together in some way through my experiences being outside and living in Telluride all of these years. And my paintings are not a literal translation of the landscape that I'm in, but those images come to me as I'm working the colors of the sky and of the sun and of the forest and of leaves and of water. And I'm not literally trying to create specific imagery that is um, something that I've seen outside, but I think those images are, are in me and they're coming through me as I'm making this work. So becoming an artist full-time is, uh, it's a risk. There's a risk that you take. Will people like your work? Uh, will people buy it? Um, you're putting yourself out there, you're very vulnerable. And that's scary. It can be very scary. And I think the more that you do it and the more shows you have, the less fear there is involved. I feel like I'm just starting, I'm just scratching the surface on this next path. And I have so many new ideas that I wanna do, you know, even with the work that I'm doing now, the two-dimensional work. So I have a long, long career, I think, ahead of me of exploration and change and doing a lot of things differently. I look forward to that. I think I have, like so many people, just a desire to keep learning, to keep doing, to keep being productive, to keep making a difference in the world and in my life. And I, I, I feel like there's so many things I have that I haven't even done yet that I want to do. And I just think it's a curiosity and a desire to keep learning. <laughs>